Hi all, welcome back to the channel Techno section. I hope you all are doing good. So today I'm here with a new video where I would be showcasing what are the different ways we can use to open CMD. So without any further ado, let's get started. So is there is a very common way which we always use to open CMD, which are quite familiar with all of us, is to just click on the star icon in the left corner and just type CMD over here and we can see command prompt. Apart from this, I would be showcasing some more steps. So let's continue with the old legacy which is going on. So whenever you type CMD, if you want to open the normal prompt, you just click on open and it come up in front of us. Whenever we want to open the admin command prompt, we just need to click on run as administrator and it will come up in front of us like this, administrator one. So this is the difference which usually we see in an administrator or a normal command prompt. So if it is written administrator the top left corner, then it is open with administrator rights. What are the ways we can use is in Windows 10. It's only for Windows 10, not for Windows 7 or 8. On the Windows keyboard, you need to press window key and the X as an X-ray. As soon as you do that, you will find a menu at the left hand side. Over here, I want to share one more thing, like as we are aware from CMD. So in Windows 10, there is another tool which is highly populated, which is known as PowerShell. So PowerShell is just like a father of CMD. The reason being that what are the commands which we have in CMD, we have all those in PowerShell as well. Because PowerShell is running with a new script in CMD let instructions. So all those instructions which can be played over CMD can be played over here as well in PowerShell. And there are much more advantages of PowerShell as well. So we will go deep if I create any such video in future. So pressing the window shell is just similar to like we are opening CMD and here we have so whatever things we are able to do in CMD, we can perform the same over here as well. As you can see, it is exactly the same. Everything will perform work same as we're able to do in CMD. So it's similar. So that is another way. Apart from this, let's suppose you want to open it from the task manager. So over here, I want to share for those who are not aware, the shortcut key to open the task manager is to press Control Shift and Escape key on the keyboard. As soon as you do that, it will open the, the task manager in front of you. Click on File, click on Run New Task, and then type CMD, Enter. CMD will be in front of you. Now over here, the easiest way is just click on file on your keyboard you need to press control key press and hold it down control key and click on run new task only once here you can see administrator command prompt in front of you so without any single prompt it will directly come in front of you so that is another way from which we all are not familiar from now let's talk about another way let's suppose we want to open the command prompt from its original location so just press windows and r and over here we can type system two. So, so here we type system three two over here and push enter. It will open up the location. So under Windows, Windows, and then system thirty two, we can find the CMD application. So just press the keys on your keyboard, which is CMD, and it will directly get you to CMD over here. If you want to open the normal prompt, just hit enter or right click on it, run as administrator to open it in the administrator prompt let's suppose we are in the middle of something and we are in the middle of the folder so this is a image i want to share let's suppose we are over here at this place we want to open the command prompt without going anywhere so either what we can do click on the top navigation bar over here and just type cmd and hit enter it will open up like this and there's another i want to share let's suppose we are over here and we want to open the CMD from here itself in this below section by doing the right click as we normally do we cannot see any such thing listed over here neither it's command prompt neither it's powershell showing up however we just need to do a quick change we just need to press down the shift key on the keyboard while pressing the shift key to a right click and then we can see open powershell w and here we can see so this is another way where we can open the command prompt like this and we can perform the several functions we want. But over here the thing to note 
thing only works over folder if you have any application over here like suppose this is the exe file over here if i press the shift e and do a right click on it nothing will show up like this so ensure this functionality will only work over the folders so this is all for the video guys if you do like the video do like it if you didn't like it do dislike it as well if you have any feedback to share please mention it over the comment your feedback is really appreciated thank you see you soon bye bye